Katherine Johnson, American Mathematician Johnson was born Katherine Coleman on August 26, 1918, in White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia. A bright child with a gift for numbers, she breezed through her classes and completed the eighth grade by age 10. She was the youngest of four children. Her mother was a teacher, her father was a lumberman, farmer, and handyman, and worked at the Greenbrier Hotel. Johnson showed strong mathematical abilities from an early age. Because Greenbrier County did not offer public schooling for African-American students past the eighth grade, the Colemans arranged for their children to attend high school in Institute, West Virginia. At first, Johnson worked in a pool of women performing math calculations. Catherine has referred to the women in the pool as virtual computers who wore skirts. Then, one day, Catherine was temporarily assigned to help the all-male flight research team. Catherine's knowledge of analytic geometry helped make quick allies of male bosses and colleagues to the extent that they forgot to return me to the pool. While the racial and gender barriers were always there, Catherine says she ignored them. Catherine was assertive, asking to be included in editorial meetings where no women had gone before. She simply told people she had done the work and that she belonged. Johnson co-authored 26 scientific papers. Her social influence as a pioneer in space science and computing is demonstrated by the honors she received and her status as a role model for a life in science. Johnson was named West Virginia State College Outstanding Alumnus of the Year in 1999. President Barack Obama presented her with the Presidential Medal of Freedom, one of 17 Americans so honored on November 24, 2015. She was cited as a pioneering example of African-American women in STEM. Katherine G. Johnson refused to be limited by society's expectations of her gender and race while expanding the boundaries of humanity's reach. NASA noted her historical role as one of the first African-American women to work as a NASA scientist. Two NASA facilities have been named in her honor. On May 5, 2016, a new 40,000-square-foot building was named the Katherine G. Johnson Computational Research Facility and formally dedicated at the agency's Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia.